Hey Virgo, thank you for tuning in with me for this weekly message. Please take care to resonate and leave whatever don't. Everything may not resonate with everyone because this is a weekly message, a general message. <laughs> not a personal if you want a personal the information is listed in the description of this video along with so much more other information i am a psychic medium which just means i do not use any cards or any tools when it comes to reading you um as shown in live q a messages uh psychic medium uh q a's which is on wednesdays and saturdays wednesdays is between eight o'clock well seven between seven and eight o'clock p.m eastern time Saturdays is between 1 and 2 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Um, I also do games, give you a chance to win, a, uh, to win so you can get a question answered. And um, I am also in Patreon, Patreon for daily messages, weekly messages, monthly messages, meditation sessions, crystal readings, uh, chakra readings, also so much more. Uh, definitely tune in over there so you can join us. Let's get into the message for Virgo. I will, never mind. All right, Virgo. Dang. All right, children in reverse. Show us more for Virgo. Soulmate and Virgo. Separation. Heart to heart conversation. Your love life is being affected by children. But with this being in reverse, I'm getting like your love life is not being affected by children. So either this person do not have children or the children is not going to be a, a, a issue due to you coming into a connection with this person or your child is not, that's not going to, your child or children, something like that is not going to be an issue with this soulmate. Okay. So I'm getting like, I don't know what's going on this week but it, it's giving me like endings well yeah that makes sense we coming into scorpio endings bring in new beginnings so it's like ending of connections um uh, possibly a, a, you know the past connection wasn't so healthy but you're moving into something more but let's see but there's definitely a separation here time apart from your partner is on the horizon we have a soulmate yes this person could have been your soulmate that does not mean it's supposed to be forever we have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. So, this could be someone you have children with. And you and this person could be going into separation. Or this person could be going into separation with someone that they have children with. But let's see more. We're going to get... We're going to see. Show us a message for... Yeah, children is involved some way, somehow. Let's get a message for Virgo. Virgo, maybe you have a boy and a girl with this person, or you have two boys or two girls, or you could have a boy or a girl. For some of you, you have two children, you have three children, or you could have more. Show us more on this energy for Virgo. Virgo, we have the golden mirror. Uh, what? What did I just say? <laughs> the golden mirror. Self-absorbed narcissist. One side of relationship. Love bombing. Oh Lord. What else for karmic relationship? That's all we needed right there. And one more. Separation. Wow. So, yeah, you coming into a separation with someone for sure. Because why is karmic, okay? Fleeting triggers, turmoil, resentment, lessons, letting go, and loving you. Separation, sadness, missing you, thinking, of, thinking about you, yearning, unsure of the future. Uh, Yeah, let this play out because... Uh, whether I'm talking to you, Virgo, or the cross watcher, cross watcher, whoever I'm speaking to, pertaining to this, let this play out. Don't force anything. Don't try to uh, force any changes. Like, just let, let it play out the way it's supposed to play out. Because this don't look like this is supposed to stay together. Not at the current time. Let's get more on the children's spirit for Virgo. I mean, it's a karmic, a karmic relationship, so show us more on children. So I'm getting like someone could be like, no, please stay. Let's work it out for the children or blah, blah, blah. No, like let that man go. Let that, that woman go. Okay, let him go. 
Trust and believe. You're going to feel fine. You're going to be just fine. Because whoever this is, they was not supposed to continue the journey with you. It was time. The time is up. Karmic. Learn a lesson from this. Let's get more on the children. Children in reverse. Or this is who, you know, take it however. Please, Virgo. Show us more on children in reverse. Ace of Wands in reverse. Someone, okay, so someone is like, I'm not the pappy. I am not the daddy. I am not the mama. <laughs> no, but, um, <laughs> that's what I say. So I say, I'm not the mama. Like, dang, you ain't know. All right. <laughs> All right, so. We have children in reverse with the ace of wands in reverse. I definitely feel like someone uh, could be rejecting a child's parent, child's mother, child's father. Someone is not sexually uh, uh, attracted. Someone is not passionate about this person anymore. Someone don't want it. So this don't necessarily have to be you. This could be someone that, that they were dealing with. This was their ex, their baby mother, their baby father. However, it's like there is no interest in it anymore. Shows more on soulmate. Or this is you. You don't have interest in the person that you have a child or children with anymore. Soulmate justice. Justice is being served. Things are being balanced out in a soulmate connection. Soulmate is pertaining to, like I said, let things play out. Soulmate connection could be this karmic relationship. Yes, a karmic can be a soulmate. Let's see more on the separation for a Virgo. Separation. Show us more on separation. Separation, yeah. Someone is not interested. Someone is rejecting, rejecting offers, not wanting anything. Like, someone is like, someone is trying, to, whoever this is, is like, come on, like, hmm, I got you some, no thank you. Someone is definitely pushing, someone is pushing somebody back. Um, hmm. A lot of karmics is just being released at this time. Lessons is being learned. It's time for a new cycle. That's all. Show us a message for Virgo. But they're very persuasive. They're very tempting. They like to tease you or tempt you by being sexual with you or uh, being trying to be. But I feel like someone lost all, all interest. Someone is like, okay. Like someone... <laughs> Some of them put on a they sexy dress and heels and someone like, okay. And the wing got their hair done, their nails done, they smelling good. <laughs> They're like, I'm gonna put on my the favorite perfume. The perfume I know this person like. Uh Virgo, you like it's like when you lose that interest, it's gone. It's nothing someone can do. And that's what's going on here. So whether this is how you're feeling towards someone, got your lips turned up, like, mm-mm. Or this is how someone else is feeling towards the person that they're trying to uh, release themselves from or, you know, go through separation with. But they're very tempting. Look at this. It's like, but oh, come on. I know you want me. You still want me. He like, man, I'm not even interested in you. I don't want nothing to do with you anymore. So it could be flip. It could be the female that's saying this about, the, you know, to the male or whatever. But. I feel like someone's lost total, total interest. Um, I don't even feel like I need to move forward with this. I am going to extend this, though, gain more information. But let's see it just a little bit more. I don't want to leave you like this. Show us more for Virgo. Let's get one on an Ace of Wands in reverse. Ace of Wands in reverse for Virgo. Ace of Wands in reverse. Clarify with the Queen of Wands in reverse. This is that person that play games who's very uh seductive. Yeah, this is this could be someone that's very seductive and um they try to play these mind games. Yeah. This is someone who is very um manipulative. This person could be trying to manipulate you or manipulate this person into having sex, but it don't look like it's going to work. It's like nope. Someone do not want someone. Someone could be dealing with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Show us more with justice. 
clarify justice. Justice is clarified with the seven. I told you. This is a soulmate. It's causing illusions. This person is uh playing with hella game. Someone playing with trying to play with your mind, Virgo. Someone is not. What's up? They playing. They they telling you what you want to hear. Or this you. Someone is a snake. Someone ain't real. So I mean. <laughs> I mean, they not being real. Show us more on the Four of Cups. For Virgo. Clarify the Four of Cups. Four of Cups. The Emperor. Yeah, so you, I feel like you like you and your Emperor energy. Look, I'm controlling this situation and I don't want this anymore. So you're rejecting whoever this is. Someone could be dealing with the Aries or you could have the Aries placements. But someone is in this energy like, no, nah, I'm good. I'm good on you. I'm good on you. Yeah, but someone is steady trying to give an offer. Someone is steady wanting to work on it. Someone is someone is a pushover. Someone is just like, it's kind of annoying. Whoever this is, they're annoying. It's like, dang, didn't I say no? It's like, dang, didn't I block you? <laughs> Why you steady call? Why you calling from other numbers? Like I blocked you. Like someone is just a bugaboo. It's like, I'm going to get what I want. That's this energy. I'm going to get what I want. Even if oh, you don't want me, but I'm going to make you want me. Like, what? This person don't want you? Like, no, leave them alone. Leave you alone, Virgo. They need to leave you alone. Or this could be the other way around. But it's a lot of clarity that's being shown upon. It's like, ah, ha, ha, ha. I see what I see your games. I see what you're trying to do. So guess what? I'm walking away. Someone is walking away. Oh yeah. Someone is putting their foot down. Someone is not playing. Oh, all at the bottom of the deck with the strength. Yeah, someone is not playing. Someone is definitely putting their foot down. Someone is like, nah, this is not how it's about to work. You're not about to control me or try to tempt me into whatever the heck you're trying to do. I'm good on you. So yeah, someone is. Someone is a bugaboo. They need to go. Like, leave me alone. All right, Virgo. We're going to dig deeper in the extended uh, version reading uh, part two in Patreon. So, I'll see you there for those who are joined. And if not, you can do definitely look into the description for the link and tune in over there. But until next time, if not, if not, um next week i'll be providing another weekly so see you later and many blessings